that the Premier League's two outstanding players this season are Jose Mourinho rejects does not reflect well on the Manchester United manager. The full stories behind the sales of Kevin De Bruyne and Mo Salah during Mourinho's time at Chelsea are more complex. HAD De Bruyne shown more patience, for example, he may be tearing apart defences alongside Eden Hazard rather than David Silva. But the narrative that Mourinho showed the door to the two men who will battle it out for the season's individual honours holds true. Which is why the future of Anthony Marshall will be so fascinating. Oh, and a night when Salah scored four for Liverpool, Marshall ran down blind alleys. The Frenchman was arguably more effective than Alexis Sanchez has been in recent weeks, but that is not saying much. Oh, right now, he just doesn't look like a Marinho player, even if he has produced more on the left than anyone else at United this season. Arjun Robin, he is not. The question is whether Mourinho will give him the chance to develop into the world class forward he has long been tipped to become. Surely he cannot risk Marshall becoming the next of Brian or Salah, who only flourished after seeking pastures away from the Portuguese manager. United want to tie the 22 year old down to a new long term deal. The club's hierarchy consider him a player with the potential to become a superstar of the game. But in a week, when Mourinho laid down the gauntlet to his players, will he have the patience to let Marshall blossom? Coming to the end of his second season in charge at Old Trafford, he is in a hurry to complete his overhaul. The signing of Sanchez was evidence of that. A 29 year old who represented a direct threat to emerging players Marshall and Marcus Rashford. A player who in theory was the finished article, capable of making an immediate impact. Marshall is still a work in progress. He has the ability to thriller infuriate. Beautifully balanced, with pace, power, and an underrated finishing ability, he has all the tools to be the complete forward and live up to comparisons with Diary Henry. Equally he can give away possession too easily, run into cul-de-sacs, and in the case of one first-half opportunity against Brighton, fluff his lines. The same could have been said of Salah even on occasion this season. But his outrageous performance against Watford on Saturday has only led to more observers likening the Egyptian to Lionel Messi. Salah has benefited from honing his talent at Roma before soaring at Liverpool, following his Chelsea disappointment. C. E. Brian did likewise at Wolfsburg and is now the talisman of a Manchester City team full of superstars. Maybe the same would happen to Marshall if he stepped out of the limelight at Old Trafford, but the challenge for Mourinho must be to harness his talent while in the red of United. That is what Sir Alex Ferguson did with so many developing players nurturing Ryan Giggs, David Beckham and Cristiano Ronaldo through fluctuations in form. Marin Hall has already answered those who criticised his record for giving you the chance by providing room for Rashford, Jesse Lingard and Scott McTominay in his first team. Inspiring Marshall to realize his full potential could be one of his biggest challenges of all. Get all the latest Manchester United news first with our new app.